just look at those snowflakes zooming by our camera up in Malta with our Mohawk Chevrolet cam. We have been seeing some passing flurries, light snow since last evening. And as you're waking up, looking out your window, you may be surprised by a little light snow that accumulated. Kind of surprised us here in the Storm Tracker weather team as well. Plenty of clouds, just some low level moisture, and it's not taking a whole lot to squeeze out these flakes this morning. We'll continue to track some flurries, light snow through the morning commute. So heads up if you're going to be traveling along the throughway, Northway, I 90 as well. Everybody dealing with some snowy conditions this morning. More snow flying through the western Mohawk Valley, heading up into the southern Adirondacks, starting to see it fill in just a little bit more. Closer to the spa city, heading down towards Scaticoke, most of Rensselaer County now. At least flurries, little light snow action that continues towards I 90 as well. So we'll continue to track these snowy conditions through the start of the day. Again, just a thin layer out there, certainly just enough to make things a little bit slippery in some cases. Still a lot of cold air draining south as we interact with these clouds, a little bit of moisture coming off of the Great Lakes. So again, wouldn't be surprised if we see more of these scattered flurries, light snow showers we move through the afternoon. May see a few more pop up as we get towards the middle part of the day. You'll also notice here on Futurecast, Temperatures not warming a whole lot today, just setting our sights on the low to even mid 30s on the high side. A little bit of clearing happens tonight, so we will be waking up colder tomorrow. And little by little as we go through the day on Thursday, we'll see some breaks for sun. Better opportunity for snow showers off towards the west, where between now and the evening tomorrow, you may see an additional one to two inches for everybody else. Maybe just a coating at best as we continue over the next 24 hours. So flurries, isolated snow showers today. Cloudy cold outside of that 34 for a high temperature this evening. The earliest sunset of the entire year. Fortunately, things will start to get a little bit lighter longer as we look towards the end of December. But of course, we are entering that time of the year. I hate to say it where it's just getting a whole lot darker. We have the shortest uh, number of hours of daylight around this time of the year. Tomorrow, best snow shower chance will be west. Then it gets brighter, milder on Friday, warming things up in a big way as we head through the weekend. Strong front gets here on Sunday, bringing heavy rain, some rumbles of thunder, gusty conditions too. They'll send temperatures back down early next week. The only good part of it being dark in December is they turn on those lights a little early. Right, right? you get to enjoy them longer. Yeah, enjoy the <laughs> Christmas lights. Thanks, Joe.